So this is where we were fishing. I'll mark where we were and where we were going along the shoreline. We were fishing big rocks and whatever kind of rocks because the largemouth and smallmouth were in there feeding up, feeding on crawfish. So we tried to match the hatch with um, soft bait crawfish and we were just pitching it in the rocks and let you know kind of letting the current use it and flop it around make it look real and then smallmouth and largemouth were just in the rocks just feeding hard on crawfish um it was a really fun afternoon really nice out it was just great and one thing about fishing rocks is sometimes it can be kind of hard because you can get snagged up a lot. But we didn't really have that 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 night, so it was a good night. One more thing, uh, like I said, how we were using our bait, that crawfish bait, we would throw it in there, and the current could uh, pound it around a little bit, make it look real and stuff. All we would do is just kind of twitch it along the bottom. That's really about it. And then the large mouth and small mouth would just hammer it because that's what they want. All right, so we're out at the Mississippi going after large mouth bass and small mouth with these crawfish baits. First one here. And then our second one on the Mississippi. Uh, the crawfish are up in the rocks and all that and the fish are feeding. So that's why we're here trying to get it hooked up in one. So let's get to it and see what happens. Uh, 30 pound test line by the way too. First cast. I had something on there. Messed it all up. So, I'm going to fix this and cast back out. That was pretty quick. Second freaking cast and I got something. It's a small mouth. I'm going to bring them up. Just like that. <laughs> yes, baby. Small mouth. That's what I'm talking about. It's just a small little guy, but dude, it's happening just like that. Every cast, I need to get another bait for this guy. I'm happy I bought a whole bag because it looks like I might need it today. Let's go! Yeah! Blue Shadow Outdoors. This is freaking insane. Here's another smallmouth. Third cast and a, another bite with a smallmouth on it. Small little guy. Let's get him back. Try to get more. This is awesome. Like I said, I love smallmouth. It's my favorite fish. Uh, you better watch out. I might turn this uh, blue shadow outdoors into smallmouth outdoors. <laughs> Look at that. Let's go. Some type of crawfish. Alright guys, they got a largemouth bass on the crawfish. Nice one too. Alright, there he is. I'm gonna get the net and net him up. into the deeps. Got a small mouth. A freaking fighting one. Let's go, dude. Woo! This is awesome. I am having the day of my life, dude. These guys just fight like crazy. Look at that. Woo! Oh, 
If I only can get him up, dude, he doesn't want to come up for nothing. This is awesome. Look at him. Whoa. Let's go. All right, I'm going to get him brought in here. All right, here he goes back. And gone. Uh, uh, all the action today happened on this crawfish here, the Ber Berkeley power bait. Every fish caught in this video was caught on this guy. So I'm gonna call it here. So see y'all next time. It was a great afternoon catching smallmouth and largemouth. Let's go. See y'all later.